it's, it's a fight. It's two, two men getting there with two fists. They've got two legs and a head. And it's, it's, it's a fight. Anybody can win, anybody can lose. You can have a great training camp. You could go in on fight night and it just might not be there for you on fight night. It's just the way it is. I take no fight for granted. I've trained my arse off for this fight. I've put everything into it. So I'm going to produce the performance on the night. It's been a, obviously a frustrating period um, for a lot of fighters and including myself, but do you know what, it's, it's boxing and it's, it's just, it is what it is, the whole world's in a pandemic right now and it's just, I've stuck to my trade, I've, I've, I've trained all the way through the lockdown, kept myself in, in good physical and mental condition. You know, I'm ready to put it all together now on, on fight night. I've been through a lot of adversity in my life and I got through a lot of it. I'm here today and I'm, I'm, I'm strong as ever and I'm in the best state of mind and physical condition that I can possibly wish to be in. It's all playing a part in, into fight night. May 29th and I'm going to put it all together. I'm fighting a South African fighter, good fighter, Azinga Fazili. He's a good slick southpaw fighter. He's got one loss on his record. A Russian guy, Rakimov, who's mandatory for the title. My fight with Azinga is a final eliminator for the number one shot at the title. I'm one step away. It'll be a dream come true when it comes through, but it's, it's, it's not come easy. It's, it's hard work and years of dedication and sacrifice from myself and people around me and my trainer, Tony Sims, who owe a lot to. He's had me since I'm a kid. Um, to, to, to get in there, we're getting there. Well, he's an elusive fighter. He's, he's sharp, he's good counters and stuff. He's, uh, um, he's a I've got a good defence, like he's got a shoulder roll going on from. I'm gonna, I'm gonna nullify all his work and I'm gonna take him out of his, out of his stride and out of his game and, and do a job with him. It is a big night for British boxing and I'll be honoured to step up to the plate and, and take my little slot in there as well. And I won the British title in 2016. I defended it outright in the space of 10 months against three southpaws. All them, all them fights and. They all they build up the experience and I believe it's all fell into place now for, for this air fight and I've just got to produce it on the night and just do it on the night. Win at all costs. I want to look good as well. I'm, I'm, it's going to be the first time I've fought in, 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 in America, in Vegas. And it's, as I say, it's a trailer dream to, to fight in Vegas on the big stage. So I want to look good and I want the whole world to open up, open up their eyes and say, do you know what this guy can contend and will contend with the best at 130. And uh, they'll soon see. I'll get this win cemented and I'll be mandatory for the world title, 130 pound world title. It'll be a good fight. It'll be a very exciting fight for the first few rounds. I'll get I'll get it to him. I will be too smart. I think I'll be too big and strong for the guy. Listen, it's just it's it's, it's this close I'm this close. I'm this close. I'm not letting this go through my hands. This I'll get this win first. I'll bring this title home. <laughs>